Hi guys, this is going to be kind of a different video than I usually do. You usually see me hauling stuff from mainly the 99 cent store, um, that kind of thing. But today I figured I'd do a little something different. And this is going to be a review for the 5 Drawer um, Recollections Letterpress, I think that's what it's called. You can find it at Michael's. Um, I had originally purchased the one on the right. Probably a few years ago, I'm going to say probably a good four years ago. <coughs> Sorry about that. And this is where I keep mostly all of my makeup. And I know to some people this might seem outrageous, but it is what it is. And I obviously needed places to put it. So everybody collects different things. Some people collect you know tools some people collect makeup some people collect you know planners some people collect crafting supplies or craft you know they're very crafty makeup is what makes me happy so it is what it is so like I was saying this is mainly a review it's not a makeup collection which I do plan on doing but I'm still trying to fidget with how I organize some things as you can see right over here, right below my vanity, I have um, some Muji drawers that I used to put my makeup and then that's when I kind of moved it over to the Recollections um, drawers. So like I was saying, about four years ago, I bought the Recollections 5 drawer letterpress from Michaels and I got it on sale in store. Um, I think I paid like $35 because these things often go on sale. Originally, they're like $89, which I would never pay $89 for that. Um, it is a dupe, sort of. I can't compare side to side because I obviously don't own that. It's supposed to be a dupe for the Alex drawers from Ikea, which I don't have an Ikea near me. The nearest one is about, I'm going to say about 2 two and a half hours away so and the shipping is kind of ridiculous it you're almost paying as much for shipping as you are for the item and I'm not quite sure if like after a certain amount you get free shipping but that was not an option to me so when I saw this on Instagram a few years back I decided to go in store and look at it and then I waited till it went on sale like I said originally it's like $89 and then I ended up paying about $35 with the sale that they had at the time. The only, and as you can see, I've purchased recently another one. And I actually ordered it online because they didn't have it in store. But I am sad to say they are not exactly the same. Um, I would say the older one is a lot better quality than the newer one. They just feel different, and obviously on camera you're not going to be able to see. This one just feels more sturdy than this one, even the texture of it. The older one feels a lot sturdier than the new one does. The other thing that I noticed from the old one versus the new one is that the drawers on the old one do not come out. Like, they just they have a stop. I don't know if I did something wrong when I put the new one together, but I'm pretty sure I didn't have any missing pieces when I was done. Um, like I didn't have any pieces, like extra pieces I should say. So I did exactly everything that the instructions told me to do. And the new drawers, you can actually pull the entire drawer, which I'm going to do. Sorry for the shaking camera. As you can see, the drawer comes out completely out. And also what I noticed, the other thing that's different is that the little rails on this one, and I don't remember because my ex actually put the old one together for me. No, the rails are exactly the same. I just don't know what the deal is, and it's not real wood, as you can see, it's that plywood type of material and obviously they're painted white um I don't know the new one just seems a lot cheaper in quality and 
I gotta say I prefer the old one not only because it feels more sturdier it doesn't feel cheap um, I paid exactly the same price for them I got them exact same you know well I got one in store one online but ultimately they came in they came from the same store um, I much prefer the old one where the drawers don't come out and like I said I did everything exactly what the instructions told me to do um, and they do come with wheels which you have the option of putting on the wheels or not I just think the wheels make it a lot easier if you're going to move it wherever you're gonna place this at <clears throat> the drawers are a good size as you can see they are a pretty good size and then to organize my makeup I usually use like different types of containers to kind of keep things contained within the drawer so they're not just kind of juggling all over the place and ultimately get damaged um but I mean overall they're a good price if you are comparing or trying to get something more affordable than the Ikea ones um because I know Ikea never has them on sale and then if you're like me and you don't have an Ikea near you then you have to drive and or pay the shipping cost which I think it's outrageous what they charge for shipping so um and I had wanted one of these when I purchased my first one. I had wanted one of those IKEA drawers for a long time after seeing pretty much everyone on YouTube has one of those drawers. And But after I saw the price of the actual you know, drawer system and with the shipping, it was just not going to happen. So when I saw these at Michael's, um, I was very happy that they had something very similar. Like I said, overall they are pretty sturdy they haven't fallen apart on me and like i said my oldest one's probably about four years old because i have a four-year-old and i had this probably a good probably a good six months before he was born and then this new one i just got probably like a month month and a half ago um but they do feel cheaper so I know some people on Instagram had asked me questions and people had um, sent me like a private message asking me, you know, kind of the quality of it. So I figured I'd do this video and kind of answer all of those questions. So I hope you got what you needed out of this video. If not, you can always leave me a question down below. I'm trying to be better about responding to comments, but um, I am a single mom of two. So I don't always have time to respond to comments. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you found it helpful. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.